Superlight was established uh, early part of 2012. Uh, it was sold in need in the UK for uh, a solid tile conservatory roof to replace uh, polycarbon and glass conservatory roofs. There are over four million conservatories in the UK and a lot of them are cold and damp and wet in the winter, too hot in the summer. People just simply aren't using them. We decided to change the roof because in summer it was far too hot to use and too cold in winter we weren't able to use it. We wanted something that would stabilise the temperature. You turn it into a room that you can use all year round with a super light roof. It's got full building regulations. It's an investment when you come to sell your property. Some of our householders have come back to us and said they've had their property valued after having a super light roof and the increase in value has gone up considerably because they see it as an extension and not just a damp cold conservatory. What goes into a super light roof? The first component, if you like, is the structural grade uh, ring beam, the aluminium ring beam. Um, so that's the section that will sit on top of the existing frames once the old roof has been completely removed. From there we would have what we call the rafters and the ridge. Inside the rafters we would have the 100mm of insulation. There and afterwards we would have your board, your breathable membrane, battened out and your tiles. On the inside of the superlight roof you would have this 50mm of insulation making a total of 150mm and your plasterboard and that's what you would plaster would come in and, and do a general skim. We can see on this section here the rafter pre-battened in the factory to make on-site work uh, as little as possible and we can also see the battens and the gap between the tiles and the membrane. It's very important to create that airspace to prevent any possibility of any condensation and we have a tile pleat starter at the beginning there to make sure there's a couple of millimetres so that you do get that through floor. An important feature of a super light roof is the ring beam and the ring beam incorporates this fascia soffit detail and that can be colour matched in keeping with the rest of the property generally. The other advantage to this fascia soffit detail of course is that it allows the homeowner to have some external LED lights perhaps looks very very nice when you see a super light roof from the outside. On the inside you can have LED lighting should you should you wish. So that pretty much is the makeup of a of a super light roof. In the early days when we started off we had very basic machinery. Uh, a lot of it was labour intensive, manually drilling and cutting and as the numbers of roofs that we got in through the uh, manufacturing each week increase, we decided to invest in uh, fully automated CNC machinery and this, this allows us to get us a higher output and there's, there's less room for error. Uh, so each time when the roof turns up your door it, it's 100% uh, correct. A fitting team will generally take, depending on the size and the complexity of the roof, between three and five days. Superlight seemed very professional when they came. We liked uh, the people and uh, we were very pleased with the quote that they gave us. It was really impressive to see how the thing was put together. Um, the finished product was brilliant. We were really pleased with it. The dangers of not removing the existing roof structure on an existing conservatory is simply it, there's, there's a chance it could collapse. The original roof structure has been designed just for polycarb, no glass. If you start to add insulation, plasterboard, tiles, felt and battens, that's around about 46 kilograms a square metre. The roof structure was never ever designed to take that. So it's, it's important that from the window frames upward, you take the roof off. And then you put the super light roof back on, which is fully calculated for building regulations, structural calculations have been done on every profile. And at the end of it, when we finish, you'll get a certificate of authenticity and you'll also get a building regulation certificate. It meets all our expectations. The temperature is stable and we can use it all the time. It's really good. We're really pleased with it. The Superlight roof isn't merely for replacement conservatory roofs. As the market has progressed and people realise there's an alternative to polycarbonate glass, Superlight roof is going into brand new structures. So if, you, if you're even considering an extension or um, an orangery type building, Superlight roof, it can be used for that. You'll find by replacing the polycarbon and glass for just simply cladding over, as we call it in the industry, um, it would be cheaper 
because it's not the proper job and you're not going to get building regulations because if it's not correctly constructed as in a super light roof, you could be enforced by the local building control officers enforcement department and make you take that roof off and put it back to what was there originally. Additional features of a super light roof, you can incorporate a traditional opening vent should you feel as though light might be an issue. You can look at some of the other Superlight products, the Sky Vista or the Sky Oranges. At Superlight, it's not just a Superlight Conservatory tile roof system we manufacture. We have various other products that are related to the conservatory industry. And if you look at our website, you'll see the other products that are actually available. So, there you have it, a super light roof. No longer too hot in summer or too cold in winter. So whether it's a conservatory replacement or it's a new build extension, a living space you can use all year round.